Hi all, welcome back to Ron's Tech Reviews. In this video, I'll be unboxing the Thermaloid ARGB PWM fans, the TLC12S and the TLC12RS. These are the best fans that you can get for your Lian Li PCO11 case or any other similarly designed cases. You might be thinking why I'm making such a bold statement. Well, it's not only because of its performance, but also due to one of the model's cues having what is something called a reverse fan blade design which is going to make this video all the more interesting for you guys. I got these fans from AliExpress and I'll put the links in the description down below if you're looking forward to buying them. Thermorite is one of the historical known companies. Uh, they're not quite famous in the western market yet, but they're quite famous in the Asian market. Now looking at these boxes, I got three of them. Uh, all of them are three packs. Uh, two of them are the reverse fan blade design and one of them is the normal fan blade design. Uh, all of them are 120mm fans. This is the TLC12S, which is the normal fan blade design. It has a max RPM of 1500, fan noise of 25, fa airflow of 66 and a static pressure of 1.53 mm, which makes these fans quite good for both cases and on radiators. Next let's look at the reverse fan blade fans. These are the TLC12RS. The specifications of here has not much changed. Uh, the RPM stays the same. The fan noise has uh, dropped a bit, 25. The airflow also 58. And the static pressure has remained the same, 1.53 mm. The normal fan blade design one came earlier in 2019, while the 20 in 2020 they released the reverse fan blade design model. Now let's open up the normal fan blade design box. Opening the box. We are first met with this smaller box. It contains, let's see, the SATA ARGB controller. It has uh, Thermoride written on its back. And it has three buttons, B, M and S, which is the brightness, mode and speed. Next in the box is the three-way PWM splitter. And finally the mounting screws it also they have also provided the silicone screws which reduces vibration noise which is quite interesting they've given us these screws standard in the box finally we come to the fans we get three fans as this is a three pack okay let's take one of the fans out um, it looks like a normal fan, uh, quite good quality. Uh, looking at the top where the cables are, first we have this 4-pin PWM cable. Next we have the 3-pin ARGB cable and it also has a DC, DC chain port. This is the normal fan blade design, so the airflow is from the front to the back like most fans in the market. Let's put that back. Oh wait, let's keep this outside. Moving on to the reverse blade fans. Opening the box, we find this quick info sheet. It's amazingly in Chinese, just to show that the airflow is from the back to the front and all the other specifications as mentioned earlier. We get the same box. It contains all the same stuff, I believe. Yeah, it is all the same. Now moving on to the fans.
looking at these fans it doesn't look any much different from the other one it has the same cables the 4 pin pwn cable and the 3 pin argb cable with the dc chain port as you can see this has the reverse fan blade design meaning the pitch of the blades is reversed making the air flow from the back to the front so it's essentially pulling the air from the back to the front one of the grommets came out i'll just put it back in these fans are built quite well they have a good heft to it and pretty much i'd say i i am quite confident on their quality these fans look quite similar to the noctua fans also so like i mentioned before these fans are the air flow is from the back to the front making it different from the normal fan blade design which is from the front to the back you can click on the link on the top right corner which have linked to the video where i am showing off the lighting effects and a bit about its acoustics and its performance if you have any comments on these fans or you would like to know more about them please leave a comment and i will get back to you if you like this video please click the like button click the subscribe and the bell icon to be notified on the future videos i hope you all stay frosty and i'll catch you on the next one take care